and this is episode seven of my Let's Play 30 Years War. I was not around last night. My um, my company actually we volunteered at a local food bank, and after we were done with the food bank, we went out for some food and some drinks. And uh, by the time I got home, I did not feel like doing a Let's Play episode, and I really didn't have time either. So, I am ready tonight, though. I just got home, and I have not played in a couple of days, and I want to take a look at what is going on. Okay, so we are besieging Castle, but achieved nothing. We inflicted five hits to the enemy during the Siege of Bamberg. The Anholt Corps engaged Protestants at... Oh, okay. So we... That's right, we lost this battle. At Castle. Over and up. We lost this uh, battle at Castle. That's a pretty strong group of people there. So we're going, wow. <laughs> He'll probably get butchered more before he even gets out. Marauders and reinforcements arrived at Nord Nordlingen. Nord Nordlingen. Imperial detachment has arrived at Bamberg. That's a five. Thirteen hundred. Looking good. Rueville received armored pikemen. The upkeep of the units in the field has cost us three money. Your control of castle has been reduced to zero because we lost that battle. Extensive defensive works have been ordered by Protestants in Region Halberstadt. Oh, okay. So, what are we doing? What are we doing here? We have this formation that's retreating from battle. We have this formation that's not retreating and hopefully is in a fairly strong position to offset this guy coming north. We're trying to take Castle, I mean not Castle, but Bamberg, and we're not getting any breaches. That is troublesome. We have one artillery unit, heavy artillery unit. I wonder if we can play Expert Gunner again since it wasn't successful the first time. Eventually we're going to get it. I mean, we're going to get Bamberg. They might as well go ahead and surrender. Maratus is in Ulm. I think oh, we're, we're taking another artillery unit up to um, up to Tilly's force. So not really doing fantastic, but after crushing that revolt, we're, we're in pretty good shape. Um, that's right. I he's he's a good strong force, but and I plan to move him to Breslau. But since it's October, I'm not going to do that this year. I'll let him winter it out in uh, Prague. Yeah, we'll let him winter it out in Prague. So let's well, let's see what. I don't know. I don't really expect that to happen. Oh. Hmm. Morale's at 90 now. Isn't that funny that their morale always goes up 
And mine always finds a way to go down. Even when nothing's happening. Bamberg is besieged, besieged and totally breached. And we are active. Oh, geez, I hope this, you know what I'm going to do? Sorry, but sorry that I have to do this, but I'm going to actually turn sounds off for now. Because every time I have a battle, the sound glitches and just goes into a circular glitch where you just constantly hear the sound over and over and over and it just gets to the point where I can't even listen to it. Um, an attempt to perform was unsuccessful. A landmine, <coughs> excuse me, a landmine opened the breach in the enemy defense. So that's where the breach came from. The upkeep of the units cost three money. Anholt's Corp, Anhold Corps has arrived in Bibra. Anhold Corps suffered two hits from foul weather. Yes. He is in poor shape. We will, I guess, go this way. I'm not going to completely run away with my tail between my legs. I am at least going to put up a fight if they attack me, but I doubt that they will come after me. When I take this, hmm, that's not good. Our supply level is pathetic. Size one depot. He has no supply units to build another uh, level of depot. Supply level of 16. There's no sense of you even going. None of these cities have any depots. I got a bad feeling about that. All right. Go back to Ulmutz, because I imagine the weather is going to hit this turn. F6, nothing there. We didn't get any money from anybody. Let's just go ahead. Generate another turn. There you go. And a Bamberg is ours. Supply level is six. At least he's active. Yeah, we can get down here. Oh, wait a minute. No, Nuremberg is at 6. They're at 10. They're at 9. They're at 13. That's a size 2 fort. And that's a size 1 fort. I'll build some depots. I'll, I'll build up the depots here at Nordlingen. Didn't get any morale.
We have gained control of Bamberg. And we received money this turn. Nice. You can call the Imperial Congress. What does that mean? The Imperial Congress. As a result of the Congress, loyalty to us can grow in the diplomatic boxes of Austria, Bayern, which is uh, Bavaria, Spain, Bremen, Munster, Mainz, Trier, Saxony, Brandenburg, and Cologne. But it can also decrease if the Congress talks prove to be negative. To call the Imperial Congress costs three engagement points. Well, everything's a gamble. If that gives me a better chance, then so be it. So, um, yeah. You know, we got some money from Frankfurt and Vienna. And since we did, we'll build some of these. Not too many. And uh, we'll run a turn. I mean, well, I could look around the map a little bit, I guess. Everybody's snug in their own little places. What's the supply level here? That's pretty good. Let's uh, lock this core because I don't want him joining. Uh, two turns. All right. Maybe less if he's active the next turn. Okay, so I have him coming to Nordland, Nordlingen, and this up here I've pretty much given up right now. Um, next year will be when I'm ready to take Tilly north. I'll bring him across here, take Wurzburg, then I'll go to, well, wait a minute. I'll be in Nordlingen. So I'll go north and take Wurzburg. Then I'll go west to Frankfurt. And from there, I'll move up this road to Göttingen and take Kassel, take Halberstadt, take them all. I'll, like the joke, I won't run up there and take one. I'll, I'll walk up there and take them all. So let's execute a turn. So we're using three money each turn for upkeep. So that's that'll save me. That'll keep me for seven months. That should be enough to for the next round of income. Um, <coughs> sorry. Suddenly had a oh. The emperor has called the Imperial Congress and it has been successful for his interests. Good deal. Um, yeah. He's suffering. He's still inactive. He's worthless. Upkeep costs three. So here we are. So, let's build a depot. He's okay. He's okay. The winter months are real boring because you really can't do too much. I mean, I think if you build a bunch of depots, you can go maybe one region over and be able to conduct some offensive move maneuvers. But even then, you're going to take some attrition. So these these turns are just flying by now. Hey, hey. The weather's broken. Somewhat. He's active. Nicely done. Uh, depot. Yes, size one depot. 
Protestants have asked England for help. Well, we will ask Spain for help. Received yearly decisions. Same old, same old. Let's see. Damn. I guess it's I guess it's this this guy that's needing the all the uh, reinforcements because he's don't he's fine. Yeah, it's it's all from him. He's lost a lot. Ninety one keeps going up. Don't understand why, but somehow their morale keeps moving up. And whole court core received sixty four hits from foul weather and exhaustion. We have finished building a depot and Eichstätt. We have started building a re re depot in region Eichstätt. Too bad it's not switched. It's a little um, anticlimactic when it tells you you're building one after you've already read that you've already built it. And then Anhol Core has suffered two damage from bad weather. So he's not doing so well. Oh. Oh, I'm already asking the Spanish for aid. So that's good. What else is going on? I'm killing them in VP points, though. I don't know if that... It's hard to win a, a decision on points, but... If, it, if I am able to finish out the war without losing, I'll win on points alone. Hopefully. And he's taking forever to get there. One more turn. The Spanish king has sent some help to the emperor. Received some income from Bavaria. Not too bad. Cost three money. So see, the snow was gone for February, but it came back for March. So we're going to stay until April. And then we're going to take Würzburg. So, have I looked at... Yeah, I haven't, but there's not really anything going on. Um, sorry. Um, let's see. Let's see what Bukoy is doing. He's just resting up, ready to take Breslau, and then Gorlitz, and then come up here. We probably, well, oh, 50. We probably need to build some supply units and get them up to Bukoy because when he moves up here he's going to need to build some depots because it, that supply ain't making it from Prague all the way to Gorlitz without a depot I'm pretty sure especially in bad weather turns alright save the turn execute the turn. This guy's gonna finally get there, I guess. Hopefully. Yeah, take your time. All right. And whole core has arrived in Frankfurt. And whole core has suffered seven hits from foul weather and/or exhaustion. Supply is done. We will move it up here and let it join him. Of course, it's going to take forever. 
think we actually have two supply down here. 92 days. I guess it's, yep, mud, mud, mud. Everything's covered in mud. Let's look at the weather overlay. Yeah, this is all mud over here. This over here is clear. So, let's see. You know, this size one depot is doing all right, even with this size um, 17,000 men and 7,000 horses. That supply one depot is not doing too shabby keeping the supply up. 13 days. Yes, sir. Let's put him on offensive. It's too bad it's a size two fort. I could put it on assault as soon as it got there. And just take it, just take it away. What is this looking like? 81 and 33. We'll build two of those and we'll let them use up those. He's gonna, he's gonna sit there and gain his, his cohesion and power and replacements back. All right. Executed turn, April 1623. I'm kind of excited to see. I haven't looked to see lately if Napoleon's ready to be out yet or not, but I'm kind of looking forward to it as well. Uh, the first Napoleon game they, they built using the age odd engine is okay, but it wasn't really that great. But um, I'm, I'm expecting the second one to be a lot better, a lot more polished. Let's do Expert Gunner and Landmine. How are they? These guys haven't even moved yet. The hell? Okay. Let's see. What is up there? What is this? What is this? Uh, Imperial detachment in whole Cord Cordoba. Wait a minute. Imperial detachment. Wait a minute. Oh, that's their guy. Their guy has moved into into here. How much power does he have? I wish I could move them all out of the way. Well, it's only 28. How far, man? Um, let's look at our messages. Control of the Hanseatic cities, or Hanseatic. Control of the Hanseatic cities of Lubeck, Bremen, and Hamburg means control of their important trade resources. This will give you some money, war supplies, and engagement points. That's up here. Well, I don't... Um... 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 It looks like it's locked. But it's mine. Lubach, Lubeck, Bremen, and Hamburg. There's Bremen, there's Hamburg, and there's Lubeck. Looks like it's uh, locked right now, but I'm sure it'll probably unlock in the next couple of turns or so. Thanks to our victory, we captured 200 some armament from the enemy. We won a battle against Protestants against in Region Wurzburg. It's funny how it's misspelled or it's spelled differently in the messages than it is on the map. You'd think they'd try to, or maybe, oh, that's what it is. The region is spelt like that, but the city is spelt without an E for some reason. Of 
Group proceed Arcabussier. The upkeep of the field units has cost me three money. The garrison of Frankfurt has been mustered on day 14. I don't think we're going to lose them. Extensive defensive works has been ordered by Protestants in Region Halberstadt. Again? Okay. We're not even threatening that, but... Okay, let's see what... Okay. This, uh, the replacement situation is a lot better. Let's do one and one. Let's see what this looks like. It looks okay. Looks... I don't think I'm allowed to... Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, I am. This is the one that won't let me buy any for. All right. Let's save our turn. Hope for a breach here. Hope we capture whatever that is there. Still waiting on these supply units to come up here. We'll give them free reign over here in Castle for now. But we're coming. Hey, buddy. You're going to be in. It's going to be tough for him to beat. Cross a river and attack them unless they go down here. Cross uh, from Aschaffenburg to Darmstadt and then to Frankfurt. If they come across a river at Offenbach, they're going to lose. And he's going to lose if he goes up against this guy as well. So we'll see. We'll see. Let's see what he does. I wonder how long this video has been going on so far. I don't want to. Oh, so he just gets to retreat. Gunner again. He's still a little away, but this time he's going to find it a lot more tougher. <laughs> if that, if I can use that kind of grammar, it's going to find it tougher for him to uh, push these guys back because his power is about 900. I don't know, even know if that's still the full force that he had. And uh, he's not going to be able to push out this uh, group of 900 or so. And he's definitely not going to be able to beat Tilly. So he might rethink, might want to rethink Spinelli, Armor Pikeman. We cost three money for upkeep. An attempt to perform decision was unsuccessful. Thank you. F5, F6, F9, up to 91. Execute a turn. It is June of 1623. We've got, what, 25 more years left in the 30 years war. See, the years are just flying by. Now, buddy, you know I'm not. Oh, here's no. there's no way he can beat this guy. Oh, I'm inactive. Oh, I'm active now. I'm active now. Tax income from Frankfurt, tax income from Vienna. We are besieging Würzburg, but nothing is done. Imperial Detachment has arrived in Prague. Imperial Detachment McCoy has joined McCoy. Supply has arrived in Prague. Supply has joined Army in Prague. Upkeep has cost us three money. An attempt to perform was unsuccessful. Again. His unit's standing over the little icon that tells me if I have a breach or not. What kind of... It doesn't really say, does it? What his, what his stats are. No matter. No matter at all. So if I 
beat him decisively, then I can start moving up here probably and start taking these fairly easily. F5, nope, F, blah, 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 nope, nope, nope. Looks like we received some money. Yeah, oh yeah, tax income from Frankfurt, tax income from Vienna. All right. Oh, wait a minute, McCoy now has his supply. So, and he's active. Yes, sir. I wonder why I didn't go through there. Oh, well, either way. Might have some days to enter this region. Days is 13 and 13. Protestant, Protestant. Ah, either way. It'll take them two turns to get there. This this over here is what I'm I'm interested in. This battle. That's probably going to happen. Looks like I outnumber them two to one. The battle planners should be on. There should this should be a, a battle planner battle. And I have oh he retreated. He was. Death of Gregory the Fifteenth. Good, because that some bitch wasn't helping us at all. Wait a minute. If he's dead, how is he going to offer me aid? That's strange. That, that's not right. I was sieging him. That's not right. Ha ha, ha ha. So he's backed off. I think I will just move him back. Let him try to come across this river. Let's see what the replacements. That's good. That's good. Yeah. One. 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 Good. Good. Yeah. Somehow I've lost a morale point, and he's gained one. It says return to neutral value. What is 107 that out of balance? Come on, people. Oh, you... You blowski. Yeah, run your little tail back. The Bukoy army has arrived in Breslau. Couple of units received replacements. Anhold has been congratulated for his victory against the enemy. Thought he lost. Is this Anhold? Yeah. Somehow or another, he got um, credit for a victory even though he lost the battle. I know that happens sometimes. It's kind of the game is kind of quirky in that sense, and 
the sense that some individual units might have success and the the general be congratulated for his hit what he did and the army still lose a battle i've seen that happen numerous times it'd be nice to take this for it pretty quickly because it's already september um i'm gonna play one more turn i am going to play one more turn and then I will call it a night. I'll probably play a lot more this weekend because I haven't played in a while. Or I have I have played pretty recently, but I didn't get to play yesterday. And uh, I want to put out, you know, three or four maybe videos this weekend. So be ready for that. If you're looking for it, it will happen. Unless there's one thing that might happen that it might keep me from... Uh, my sister broke her leg this past Saturday and had surgery yesterday and she's out of the hospital and she's on crutches so I might go see her and if I do then I will probably not play at all this weekend we made a breach in Warsburg that could spell I don't know if I, I don't know if, well, we're inactive anyway. So one more turn before I try to assault. But it will not be this episode because I am bringing this episode to a close. But I will try that and try that. How many EGs do I have? A hundred and it says 154 but I it says on the little tooltip screen 164 I guess it if these cost five each that's probably the reason why okay folks um this is the end of my episode seven I uh, think you know good things are happening we capture break Bamberg which is a strategic town nicely done we are gaining 43 points per turn, victory points, and they're only gaining 14 points per turn. They've lost 10,000 men. We've lost 7,600 men. Um, yeah. We need to strategically start thinking. That says Prague is, un, is not held by anybody. I guess it's because I don't have any units in there. So what I will do, 33 days, and what we'll do is we'll have him enter the structure when he gets there. That way, well, wait a minute. Yeah, we'll do, we'll do the... We'll we'll use the infantry instead of the horse. Sometimes the sometimes cavalry won't won't register as actually controlling a city for some reason, but uh, infantry always does. And sometimes if it's militia, it doesn't. But uh, regular infantry always acts as a control in the city if it's in, it, if it's within the city. No, because it's October. We'll leave them there. I pretty much have to finish this out now. Or die trying. Okay. I'm saving the game. I will see you next time. Thanks for watching. I really do appreciate it. And if you haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. And you can like it, the video if you want to as well. I will see you next time. Thanks a lot.